wandered through the museum, it was just so amazing. And I think everybody was so humbled to see our work displayed in such a beautiful light. So uh, thank you, Portland Art Museum, for allowing us artists to share what we do. The biggest issues I ran into is that the tours we gave were only an hour long and there was so much wonderful art from the Wyeth family. There was just so much to look at but we were really limited in what we could show them in an hour. series has developed and evolved so much in the last year due to the current cultural climate that we're living in and how important it is for the arts to reflect the things we want to see. The exhibition here opens the doors of the museum trying to invite the broader community within that space, not isolating art, but rather asking art of its um, strongest and most compelling ability to traverse the lines to establish modes of communication that I find extremely heartening. Mike Murawski at the Portland Art Museum emailed and said, the Center for Contemporary Native Art is closing a show. Do you want to open one? And I said, oh yeah, I want Chill Cat and Raven's Tale to be as well known as Navajo weaving. Wouldn't that be so cool? So that was my aim, and I didn't realize that it really would reach so far. Doing these exhibitions is a privilege. It's fun to share the cars and the motorcycles. I thank Brian immensely for the opportunity to do an exhibit for a second time here. This is a museum that has done everything right. They really seem to know how to stage and promote uh, an exciting exhibition. They help in every way. And my job was to do the very best I can bringing you another good exhibit.